Good morning, divers, boaters, RVers, UTV riders, and friends of Lake Pleasant. Welcome back to Cyborg Pirate for the current conditions and forecast at Lake Pleasant for the weekend of Friday, March 8th, 2024. A little bit of water from above and water pumping in the lake. It is rising nicely and visibility is improving. Today's video is from last weekend's navigation class. It was their final checkout dive. Divers were given a destination, a compass heading, and were to lead the dives. Successfully leading the group to the destination and then by triangulating the return trip to the boat. Great job, students, and successful navigation. Be sure to hit the thumbs up and give us a like. Subscribe to the channel for the latest updates, gear reviews, and trips. Sunrise today will be at 6.46 a.m., and sunset at 6.31 p.m. With last light over clear skies tonight at 6.56 p.m. for an 11-hour and 44-minute day. A bit cooler today with the high at 60 degrees. By Sunday, 69 degrees with an overnight low in the mid-40s. Winds will be calm over the weekend with the afternoon peaking in the 10 to 15 mile per hour range today. Water, water, water. Yes, the CAP has been pumping water in and the lake is on the rise. Still four feet to go by mid-March to keep on pace with the proposed pump plan. The surface level is 1,674 feet above sea level and currently 70.6% full, pumping water in at 1,311 cubic feet per second. A surface temp of 57 degrees and 53 degrees on the bottom below the 100 foot mark. No thermocline. Visibility out mid lake remains 35 to 45 feet and improving. Everything south of the old dam has a silt cloud settling out from the large increase of water flow by being pumped in from the CAP. Expect a decrease in visibility diving from along the shorelines southeast of the old dam. 40 to 80 foot of depth is where the silt is hanging out and the worst it is settling down below that. Be kind and respectful to all users of Lake Pleasant. Know the rules of the waterways. Wear life jackets and sunscreen. Be sure to hydrate often. But most important, always remember that life is not measured by the number of breaths that you take, but rather by the number of breaths you take underwater. Cyborg out.